What's good, Bully World? This is Zeb, your host, Bully Talk with Zeb Pitts. I want to thank everyone who's supporting what I'm doing with the Real Talk with Zeb movement. I know it's something different outside the Bully World. I know a lot of supporters support me because of the Bully Talk with Zeb Pitts. But like I said in 2019, the push for me is with the Real Talk with Zeb. Is, is very, very important to me um, with this movement. With this, I, I, I can really see it going beyond what I could see, what I was trying to do with the Bully Tucker's Air Pits. And I, I'm hoping that it can really make an impact in my communities, uh, just an impact period around the world. And then, um, just to get these stories lately, man. I, I, I'm for somebody who didn't even get into that type of field and getting these type of opportunities is it's, it's it's humbling. It's humbling and overwhelming at the same time because I, I get nervous sometimes. Just because I know the passion inside of me to want to succeed in, in everything I'm doing and don't want to get boxed in. There's so much I want to do as far as the Real Talk with Zeb Media, but the main thing is really getting the stories in my community. That's 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 really not getting pushed by the mainstream media. That's, that's really a big focus for me. And hopefully, you know, people open up their doors. It's, I ain't gonna lie, it's hard in D.C. for me. I, I'm not gonna lie. I would... I would sit here and tell you a whole other story. It's not easy getting stories from me in D.C. That's why I have so much love for Baltimore. I get the stories there. I I, I get the interviews there. It, it, they embrace you, boy. I, I love b man, for real. I love my home, D.C., but it's, it's, it's such a hard... It's so hard to get the stories when you reach out to people. I don't I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's just they want to deal with the mainstream media or what, man. But you got to deal with your grassroots people, man. You know, you got to start somewhere. I'm starting from the bottom, growing this thing up, man. Just growing it up. So you with me at the bottom, you seeing it grow. You growing with me, man. So I, I appreciate everyone who's sticking with the Real Talk with Zeb brand and seeing I'm not doing as much in the bully world. Uh, still got love for the bully world. Still gonna be hitting shows. Just don't know what shows, but I'll be at shows. But right now, like I said, the real focus for me is the Real Talk with Zeb. Um, thank you to uh, the Miller family, uh, Free Derek Miller. It was great to get that news. It was great um, to hear he's coming home May 20th. And I would have never known about this story if it wasn't for uh, PFK Boom, man. Shout out to him. Doing great things up in Baltimore uh, with the 300 Gangsters uh, movement, 300 Shooters. That's for the for the youth movement up there. He's doing great things up there. And if it wasn't for him, I would have never heard the, uh, about the story of Sergeant Derek Miller. So I'm very appreciative for that, man. I'm big dog, and I really appreciate uh you always opening up your uh, your doors uh, to get the interviews up there in Baltimore. I really, really appreciate that, man. Shout out to him and Big Wolf um, for the things they're doing up there in b -more. I really appreciate it. Uh, shout out to Coach Calvin Ford for opening up his doors at uh, Upton Boxing Center. He didn't have to do that, man. And, and, and I'm appreciative to it to help me get the, the clearance. Uh, to get the interviews done and looking to do more things man just to spotlight the great things that they're doing at Upton Boxing Center like like he said man he's he's trying to make it a hub for 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 breeding for breeding champions and keep in mind he's not getting them when they already polished and and, and uh, adult and you grab them up and then you you make a champion. He's he's getting them from the youth. He's taking them from the time they five, six, seven, molding, grooming, and making champions, man. So shout out to uh, the coach Calvin Ford and uh, Coach Ellis and the things they're doing at uh, Upton Boxing Center. Uh, shout out to Lorenzo Trunk Simpson for the interview. He did it on his birthday. 
Matter of fact, he was in the gym. He's serious about this. He will be a champion. Believe that. He will be a champion. I, I, I saw the hunger and the passion in his face, man, just during the whole workout session. And, and just to see how he was as a big brother uh, to Katino. To shop all of a 15 year old man he's gonna do big things also man just to see him working with him and, and just the bond that they have there at a upton boxing center it, it was it was a great thing to see and for him uh for truck to tell the story about how javante really you know had him on his wing they like brothers man so just to hear that story and how iron shop is iron up in there man it's 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 intense it's serious but it's love up in there and I love the great things that uh, Coach Calvin Ford is doing. Hope uh, definitely won't be the last uh, for me doing things with uh, Coach Calvin Ford and Upton Boxing and and just getting the great stories out of Baltimore, man. It's, it's a great city, great people. You know, went to Morgan State, got family up there. So I'm very familiar with, with B-Boy. Like I said, I got family there, went to Morgan, didn't finish, but I went to Morgan. <laughs> Got caught up on that bridge, but uh, it's all love. Uh, yeah, I'm just just rambling today, just thanking uh, the creator for the opportunities. Like I said, I, I'm not getting boxed in. I enjoy what I'm doing with this. I want to reach out to Cong. I've been reaching out to Congress people, try to get those stories also as well. So be on the lookout for for big things with real talk with zeb in 2019 and i hope i really get the support and, and the push and the shares behind what i'm doing and for everyone that that is uh posting and sharing i really appreciate it thank you for the love and support with the brand zeb brooks media i'm out